Hey you okay sir, welcome back to the Sweet Booty Update. Before we move on to the third and final week, this is some dialogue from the previous week. So let's look at this, then move on to the third week. Peter Griffin, I challenge you to a single combat. Joke's on you, I'm married. No, I just mean we'll settle this one-on-one. -on -one. Then you're dead meat. I beat Chris in one-on-one -on -one all the time. But that's because I don't dribble, charge non-stop, and scream foul every three seconds. You hate playing against me. Sweet! High five! Brace yourselves, because I have got big news! Oh no, the candy giant chicken wants to kill me. Wait, this is just my hallucination. I'll be fine. No, you won't. If you die in the hallucination, you die in real life. Just like in every movie or TV show I've ever seen before. That's kind of true, actually. Climb reward for completing this quest line, probably 5, maybe 10. Hoping for 50. Green jelly bear can now dodge sugar, but I had so much of it. And sugar packets. After. This place is a nut house. Well, Mom, what do you think of my new cool look? You're kind of ripping off Stewie's look, but Billie Eilish dresses like a toddler, and people think she's cool, so, I don't know, I guess I'm just old. We all get old eventually, don't worry. But... Clams for completing the quest line. Candy Captain Seamus is for this final week. If you watched the previous video I just did unlocking... The character, who is it? Oh yeah, Swashbuckler Lois. I did look to see the character. Basically though, collect chocolate coins. Of course, like I've been doing the entire time. Candy Captain Seamus is trying to help, but evil Candy Captain Seamus is not. Get it straight, boyo. Made of the best candy cane, these axes are not made to last more than a lick or two. Still helpful though. Great. So what do we do now with these jellies? Throw some sugar packets on them and get vodka. The green jelly bears of course have evolved into more evil sugary creatures or Peter was distracted. So how do I get the sugar packets? Oh, we have to swap it. Swap it, swap it, swap it. We need two more of the sugar. But I can still get the sugar, right? With the net. Oh, yeah, I can. So that's good. Oh, I don't know, man. This is going to be close. All right. There we go. There we go. Oh, I missed it. Okay, that's enough. I'm getting greedy. No, this one. Sorry, Lars. I can't help you with a candy giant chicken. I'd rather walk the plank. Peter, no. You'll be eaten by gummy sharks. Do 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 do. Damn it, Peter. I finally got that out of my head. Well, you came to the right place. Jaws was a fantastic movie. What? Where am I? Ahoy! I be Captain Candy of this vessel. The name be Seamus, and this be my crewmate, Sweet Meg. We found you adrift at sea, but how did you survive the gummy sharks? It was easy. I punched them all in the face. Not because of what you're really supposed to do, but because I'm still mad I watched Shark Tale in the theater. That was an okay movie. Learn about Evil Candy Captain Seamus, One Axe, Peter, read the treasure map. The origin story of the villain is as simple as changing candy canes for licorice, very relatable. Use axes to defeat Evil Candy Captain Seamus and get candy teeth to unlock Sweet Mac. So it's going to be like the previous week then. With, what do you call it? The meteor, I think? Who gets the axes? Oh, this is all so fascinating. So Lois can. I'm standing here. Trisha. And that appears to be it. Just the two characters, unfortunately. Let's go to Evil Candy Captain Jameis. Oh, okay. You should tweet that. And four hours, and we get Candy Corn. Okay, go. So let's see. There they are. Yep, we're going up to the meter again, and they drop 
Is that a golden tooth or like a bronze tooth? Because it doesn't look very golden. Oh, is it a gummy tooth? Inventory wise, we got Candy Captain Sheamus for 270. You want to go the premium route? There you go. Lots of premium stuff. There's Sweet Meg. We've got Candy Pirate Ship, which drops two honeys. Candy Barrels, which drops one candy. Licorice Anger, which drops two licorice. And Gummy Kraken, which drops ten of the coins, which I don't really care too much about. But it looks pretty neat, so I want to go for it. We also got Candy Tree and the Sweetness Factory for 500 and 200 respectively. I think I'll probably be able to get those. I'll probably get that at the very end of the updates. But if you don't know by now, click this, go to Shipwreck Points. It takes you here. And let's place this down. Ooh, it goes in the water. That's good. Shaboom! So every eight hours, it drops a honey. Uh, and that's how we have to get these candy coins. Seamus, Bonnie, and then Peter. Well, let's unlock this character. So let's see, we need 17 of the candy, which are common. Herbert, and then the candy barrels, which of course is the craftable. This is all my fault. That's the one you want. Oh, God. Ha <laughs> Uh, who dropped it again? I don't remember. Connie? Chris? Herbert? Hmm. It was Herbert. Six hours. Fifteen of the honey, which is always from the candy pirate ship, which you saw me place down a second ago. It is eight hours. We need fifteen of the licorice, which are uncommon. Dr. Hartman, Candy Captain Seamus, and then the craftable. So, if you don't go for the premium, it's just going to be the freemium character and then the craftable. I think I may be able to help you. Eight hours. We've got... Candy Teeth from Evil Candy Captain Seamus. Remember the thing with the media like the previous week? Just keep on collecting the axes from the few characters and then just convert them over. Get those teeth. And then finally we got the vodka. That's from the gummy bears, right? That's right. 35 gummy bears. Common. Uncommon, sorry. Oh, it's the bombing. I hate the bombing. Which means you're gonna have to remove all the roads. That's how they group them all together. Makes it easier. If you're confused what I mean, let me show you. Really quickly. Just like that. So now they're all gonna walk over here and then just bomb them. So that pretty much covers it for the third and final week. It seems very, very easy. Actually, this entire update has been Quite simple. It's just been that you need a lot of the stuff. It's basically just clear gummies and you get a villain that pops up just like Seamus here and you just go up in the meter. Higher you go in the meter, more drops you get for that particular thing. Super easy. I will see eventually, hopefully, to wrap this up and then of course I will be putting down whatever I can at the end of the update. Moving forward in a sweet booty update. So thank you very so much for watching and I'll see you on the Bye, everybody.